Hey, this is Pro Video Mook. I've been working on a few GC video boards, which I'll have available at the links below. I'll also be selling the GameCube that's in this video, which will have a Xeno mod chip in it as well. And a bit later, I'll be modding a few more GameCubes and I'll put them up for sale on eBay. My method might be a little bit unique. I haven't seen anybody else do it this way. I have the component out through a 3.5mm jack, but RGB and sync is on the OEM analog out, and it's on the same pins that'd be used on a European GameCube. This way you can plug in a standard and cheap uh, SNES SCART cable uh, to get the RGB and sync out. I've been trying to figure out other ways on how to do this in an elegant manner so that I could also output horizontal and vertical sync for VGA, but nothing really satisfies me. I really want simplicity and OEM-like functionality and looks, but if you ask, I would happily add another 3.5 millimeter jack for the uh, H&V sync for anybody who buys a cube of mine, but I just like the look of the single out, and I kind of doubt whether you know VGA would be that much in demand, but tell me otherwise in the comments. Uh, I think that since the component looks so good, and the RGB is just amazing for 240p, uh, VGA will be less of a thing. Also, for anybody wanting the GC video with a different firmware, like for the N64 or the Wii or you know whatever, just let me know, and I'd be happy to flash it to whatever you wanted. Uh, as long as you provide the files. I also wanted to make it known that this production run is very limited and depending on the response I might do another more significant run but right now everything is pointing to this being my last run. Uh, unfortunately engineering grad students are kinda short on time and energy. Anyway I will be leaving with some fantastic YouTube royalty free music and cube modding and I'll see you at the end of the video.
And that's it. This cube will be up for sale on eBay. I will also be offering a few of my kits for the GC video on eBay as well. If everything goes well, I might make more of these, but I'm starting to think I might start on a more difficult project. Uh, but that's it for now. Thanks for watching and keep on modding.